What is going on there guys, it is Rocker XX Carter here bringing you a WWE 12 commentary and in this one we're going to talk about Heath Slater. What now for Heath Slater? Um, as you guys know, he like, uh, I don't know how long it was, but leading up to the Raw 1000 he was facing a bunch of legends, um, and you know he was basically jobbing to them, but now that uh, Raw 1000 is over, they already did the 1000 episode, what's going to happen to Heath Slater now guys? Um, is, is he going to disappear off TV again? Is, is he going to be rewarded for, you know, jobbing for that long? From what I've heard, he was um, he was cool about you know jobbing to these legends and everything. He didn't have a problem, and he was happy about it. So I think WWE might re um, reward him. But what I want them to do with Heath Slater is to you know give him a push. You know, maybe maybe make one of the goddamn um, legends be his manager. You know, give something to make him make him you know give him a push, give him a chance. I think. I think I'm starting to like him on the mic, and I think if he was given the chance, he would uh, definitely, definitely gain from it. And you know, I think people might uh, might like to hate him, like you know that person you love to hate. But also, before I continue, I also want to give two special shout outs to um. First one is to hold on. Let me let me see his YouTube name. Let me see his YouTube name. Um. Lineix, um, he did a background for me and the map coding and everything because I'm not good with it. And if you guys go to my profile, you can see what he did. He made me a sick ass background. I actually love it. It's featuring CM Punk and Austin Aries. Um, I'll leave his channel in the description below. If you guys want a background, ask him nicely. He's, he's a pretty cool dude. Um, you know, and he really helped me out. And I want to thank that. I want to thank him so much for giving me that background i actually love it. it it has rocker xx next to the twitter social blade and uh and his designer so if you guys want um he his link will be in this yeah sorry i uh, choked on my breath or something if you guys want to check his channel out it'll be in the description or go to my channel and click on the designer um again i want to thank him a lot for uh doing that and you guys should totally subscribe to him Ask him for a background if you guys want. He's again, he's chill. Um, and I also want to thank new WWE Superstar 100. Yesterday, I was trying to download some move sets for some move sets for Kazarian and Christopher Daniels. And you know, Community Creations, I just about fucking had it with it. It it just doesn't give me results. And when it gives me results, right when it's about to finish, the servers go off on me, and it just leaves me in a in deep range. And right now, I'm showing that deep range because I'm, I'm goddamn fucking tired of community creations. All I wanted was a move set, and you know they didn't even give me results. It was, honestly, two fucking hours, me trying to freaking download the damn move sets. Honestly, I spent two hours trying to download the move sets because I needed them for the next episode of the TNA Invasion on uh, Raw. And two goddamn hours wasted of my life because those damn fucking servers. I'm sorry, I I, I, I kind of want to be a role model and don't want to cuss. But, my god, there's only so much I can take, THQ. Please, WB13, really, become the, t the servers should become a top priority. Corey Ledesma said it's top priority. But something tells me that it's not going to be top priority. I think they're going to lie again to us like they have in the past few years. And you know, hopefully they don't. Because this game is great. It's just overshadowed by a few things that aren't awesome. Like them getting up too quickly. Um, triple threat steel cage matches are basically impossible. What else? What else? I mean, this game has a great legend AI, but the multiplayer or yeah, the multiplayer and the community creations aspect of the game just ruined it for me. But uh, this video is coming to an end, guys. I want you guys to answer the question: What do you want WWE to do with Heath Slater, or what do you think they're gonna do with Heath Slater? Um, remember, check out Lineix. Um, and you know, special thanks to new WWE Superstar 100. Rocket, it's out.